Hello lovely humans, this is Lou here for Simply Crochet and in today's video we are going to be looking at the Fan Dabby Dozy Twisterific Single Cable Stitch from issue 48. Alongside the basic stitch pattern, we've also included three very, very cute mini projects for you to get your teeth into, including a book cover, a phone cover, and a very, very cute mini pot cover for your most beloved houseplants. So in today's video, we are going to be taking a little bit of a closer look at this particular pattern. Now, because it is a more advanced stitch, I thought it might be useful for us to dissect it together and kind of see if we can get more comfortable with the various stitches and techniques used in this beautiful pattern. Now I'm just gonna be working into a row of treble crochet just to give you a rough idea of how the pattern works up. So at the beginning of your row, whichever pattern you're doing, you will be working four half treble crochet. Now I'm going to be doing this quite quickly because I'm assuming that you're comfortable with a half treble. If not, please feel free to click the link in the bottom left hand corner and it will take you to an instructional video just to get you brushed up on that. So now comes the tricky part. We are going to be working into these next two stitches as front post stitches. Not only that, but they will be double trebles. Now in your pattern, you'll see that it tells you to skip the first post and work into the second. So what we're gonna do is we are going to yarn over twice for the start of our double treble. Then for our front post, we are gonna take our hook and we are going to insert it behind the actual stitch from right to left, coming out the other side. We're then gonna yarn over and we're gonna pull that through. This will leave us with four loops on our hook. So at this point, we are going to yarn over and pull through two. Then we're going to yarn over again and pull through two. And then we're gonna yarn over and pull through the last two. Now, because we skipped that first post, we're now gonna go back and work into it. And this will be the same method as before. So we yarn over twice, we work into that post from right to left and front to back. We are gonna yarn over and pull through. We yarn over and pull through two. We yarn over and pull through the next two. And then we yarn over and pull through two again. And that is the first part of your very first cable. For the next part, we are just gonna work another four half trebles at this point. Now, depending on which pattern you're doing, you'll need to do this a different number of times. But just for the swatch, um, we're just gonna be doing two cables per row. So then we have our third half treble crochet and our fourth half treble. So as last time, we are going to be working a front post double treble. We are gonna be skipping that first one because we're gonna be coming back to it afterwards. And we are going to be working into the one to the left of that. So what we're gonna do is we're going to yarn over twice we are going to insert our hook. We're gonna yarn over and pull through. We are gonna yarn over and pull through the first two of the four loops on the hook. Yarn over and pull through two again. And then we yarn over and pull through the last two. Now, because we skipped that first post, we're now gonna go back and work into it. And this will be the same method as before. So we yarn over twice, we work into that post from right to left and front to back. We are gonna yarn over and pull through. We yarn over and pull through two. We yarn over and pull through the next two. And then we yarn over and pull through two again. We're gonna finish off this row, just for this particular swatch, I'm just gonna finish off with four more half trebles and then we'll move on to the next row. Now 
Now to start our next row, we are going to turn our work as we normally would. Now I'm gonna be working a half treble crochet into the first four stitches. So I'm gonna chain one first. And then in the next four stitches, I'm going to pop a half treble crochet. So we do one half treble crochet, two half treble crochet, there's the third half treble crochet, and then there's number four. So when we're working into the next two stitches, again, these are gonna be post stitches, but on this occasion, they are going to be back post stitches. And this time they're also only gonna be trebles, not double trebles, so we will only need to yarn over the once to begin with. So we're gonna be working into the very next stitch because there's no skipping this time. Now to do a back post, we are going to yarn over and instead of working from the front of the work and going behind that stitch, like this, we are gonna be going round the back and scooching it through. So again, with our yarn over already done, we are gonna go from the back, right to left, and then we're going to yarn over and we're gonna pull it through. Then we're gonna yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. Now we're gonna be doing the same in the next post, so it might be a little bit clearer. We'll yarn over and from the back, we are gonna go through, we're gonna yarn over and pull through, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. To continue, again, we are gonna work four half treble crochet, so one half treble crochet into the next four stitches. So there's one, two, three, and there's number four. Now we are back to our cable section. So for the next two stitches, we are going to be working back post, double crochet. So we yarn over. From the back, we're gonna insert our hook through that stitch and yarn over and pull through. And then gonna yarn over pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. So we're gonna repeat that same thing in the next post along. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna yarn over and from the back, we're going to grab that stitch. We're gonna yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. And that is the second part of your cable completed. Now for the next four stitches, I'm just gonna do another half treble crochet in each stitch. Depending on which one of these lovely patterns you have decided to take on, there'll be a different number of repetitions of these various techniques for you to do. So obviously, just have a look at your pattern, make sure you use that as your first kind of reference point. And then if you do struggle with any of these techniques, pop along and watch the video again. And I will try my very best to make it as clear as I possibly can. If you find yourself getting stuck, you know, just imagine that I'm the Patrick Swayze to your Demi Moore and I'm behind you with my muscular arms wrapped around you. I'm making this a lot more sinister than it needs to be. In all seriousness, or as serious as a person can be wearing a mortarboard anyway, if you do have any problems with the tutorial, please feel absolutely free to rewind and replay and pause and do whatever you need to do as many times as you need to do it in order for things to sink in. From all of us at Simply Crochet, have a fantastic day and we have thoroughly enjoyed getting you hooked on Handmade. <laughs>